And now I just wanted to give you guys really just a quick update video on how things are going, what's been going on, because it's been really crazy. I don't even know how to, I mean, I've been going from posting, I mean, I'm making YouTube videos for over two years and I haven't seen anything happen. I've been making it for just my immediate friends and family. Then all of a sudden I post a video and it blows up. It's at over 10,000 views now. I've never had a video break 100 and I'm like, <laughs> I don't, I don't even know what to say. And it wasn't even a good video. It was just a video that I was just gonna put together, edit, and shove it out uh, for, you know, a small circle of friends and family to see. The audio got unsynced on it and it was really annoying and I was working to fix it and I couldn't fix it. I'm like, well, it doesn't matter. No one's gonna see it anyways. And then it blew up and I'm like, great. Now 10,000 people saw it. I'm not even that proud of it. <laughs> I mean, it is what it is. And I guess people enjoy it enough and I'm happy they do. The things these last couple days have been crazy. After that blew up, it's like, you know, I gotta keep doing it because that's what people like. And I feel like I'm in this circle. Now, not that I don't enjoy it. Obviously I do. And me and my sister are filming more anime react series you know, theme reactions and stuff here in a little bit that'll be posted next week. And of course, Attack on Titan series is gonna obviously keep going. And I'm taking all the criticism, constructive constructive criticism, obviously, to heart and working on bettering it because I never thought I would be a reaction channel like this. I don't really know if you'd really call this a reaction. Well, I guess that's exactly what it is, is a reaction channel. <laughs> I'm, I'm, cause I've got, I've got to admit, this is something that is probably gonna be crazy, and you know, it might be come as a big surprise. It's a pretty shocking reveal, but I'm I'm not much of an anime guy. <laughs> I mean, there are certain series I've been watching, and uh, but I'm, I'm really late to the party when it comes to this stuff. I was always that kind of guy. It's like, man, look, I'm a nerd, but you know, anime is like, pfft, I'm not that kind of nerd, which doesn't make any sense because this is coming from somebody that collects Godzilla movies and stuff for a living. It started back whenever Death Note the movie came out, and I thought the concept was really cool, but the movie was horrible. But I heard it was based on anime, so I'm like, okay, I might as well just check out the anime because I think it's a really cool concept. Whatever, I'm gonna check it out. And then I got hooked on it, and that's what kind of started this whole thing, or my experience with anime. And that's that's pretty much been it. It's been Death Note, it's been Attack on Titan. I got really into to Dragon Ball. I've always been sort of familiar with Dragon Ball. I mean, I knew the characters, I knew who Goku was, I knew Piccolo, Krillin, like some of the main cast, but I never really... The thing about Dragon Ball, same thing with Naruto, it's like it's such a huge franchise how do you even jump into it especially someone who just got into anime not you know recently that's the reason why i never watched naruto is just because it's so big i don't even know where to begin with it and dragon ball is like that you have dragon ball dragon ball z dragon ball super all of these i mean a huge variety of just dragon ball movies it's like where do you even begin with all this stuff you know it's like you know, <laughs> how do you even begin to approach it new movies coming out every day it's like broly and all this stuff it's like, I don't even know how to approach the Dragon Ball franchise, but I just saw, happened to see Dragon Ball Z season one about six months ago at a grocery store. And I was like, whatever, I'll try it. And I got really into the series, it's really good. <laughs> what can I say? That's pretty much where my experience with the anime ends though. And uh, so yes, everyone asking about the manga. No, I've not read Attack on Titan manga. I own the first volume. Uh, but I haven't read it yet, so my foot's in the door of every pretty much series. It's like I know a little bit about anime. I know a little bit about uh, manga because I've been reading Berserk and Blam, Blame or Blam. I, th I think it's Blam. But I've been reading those two series and they're both really good so far. Uh, but like I said, I'm late to the party with both of those. I'm a big comic book fan. I don't know if you can see these over here, but it's just a big collection of comic books all back way on here. Um, from DC and Marvel. Uh, yeah, I'm wearing a Daredevil sweater right now. <laughs> uh, but if anything, I think I'm a bigger video game nerd. I'm a huge Metroid fan. And obviously, I already said it before, I'm a Godzilla nerd. I've collected all the movies and I'm pretty big when it goes into that stuff. But anime and manga, that's kind of, uh, I'm, I'm new to it and I do enjoy it, but I'm not as into it as a lot of people are. So whenever I made the video, it's like Attack on Titan was just a show I really liked. It was an anime that I watched. I got really into it after Death Note. And I was just like, you know what? I'm gonna show off to my sister. I had this really cool idea after kind of going through some YouTube videos to kind of show her the intros to, this, to the show and let her kind of tell me what the story is. I thought it was a neat idea. It blew up, so now I feel like I'm like in this room of what I need to, <laughs> of what I need to do. I want to know at least that I can still make videos to some degree, you know, by myself. I don't know if that's really possible right now, but you know, testing the water, seeing how things go. Uh, it's been very overwhelming. I'll say that. I don't know what to feel. I am really happy. I'm so thankful and so supportive. The guy, everyone's been amazing. And also keep in mind, whenever you're recommending me anime to show her, a lot of times you're recommending stuff to me too. So we even talked about what uh, next theme series we're gonna be doing, but it's like nothing's coherent. I don't even know what to begin to think anymore. There's been so many different series recommended to us that I don't even know where to begin to check to, to even start with. Attack on Titan episode three, I left a comment that asked, you know, 
for suggestions, hoping I can like narrow down the list a little bit. Uh, the only comment I've gotten thus far has been Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, which is the current anime series I'm watching right now. I'm about 15 episodes in and it's really good. It kind of got off to a slower start for me, but I am enjoying it quite a bit. Um, but I don't really want to watch the themes to that more than after that, because I don't want to spoil the show for me since I'm already kind of familiar with it. So. I don't know. We're, we're trying to figure things out. Black Butler, Black Clover has been two of them. Uh, Black Butler is something that's recommended to me personally by a lot of people I know. And I saw it recommended in the, the comments, so we may check that one out. Black Clover, I've never heard of it, but then I just happened to kind of look into it and see what it was and see if it was something I wanted to show her. And I think it looks really cool. So who knows? Maybe that's something we'll check out. Um, What else? In regards to... Sorry, my sister just got here. Oh my gosh, she's loud even when she's out there. Okay, I'm going to try and talk over her. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> uh, and concerns with the constructive criticism, which I'm very thankful for. Uh, obviously, I'm taking everything to heart right now because I've never done a series like this. I don't even know how to approach a series like this. I mean, with copyright, which is why I had problems with episode three. Whenever I'm editing it, I can't tell what I'm editing when it comes to like the subtitles. The subtitles are just a blur while I'm editing it. So I'm just going off of memory, whether it's a scene that's important or not to put in. A lot of times we're not talking over it, so that's an issue. Uh, the copyright system is really weird and I'm familiar somewhat with it and it's frustrating but I mean it happens instantaneously if your video is copyrighted it, it'll show you like the videos before I think I posted and immediately gets blocked and it's like okay it tells you where you need to trim it down at and you know what the problem is and uh, so it's helpful but in some cases it's not because there are scenes that I you know needed her reaction to or something like that so in regards to other criticism it's I think I just get excited you know showing her a series that I've loved for so long and I don't get to talk to anyone about the only other person uh, that I know that watches anime that I can talk to about it has not seen the show and doesn't really care to see it so now I have somebody else I can actually talk to about it so I, th I think I just get too excited and I'm like did you get this part did you get that part and it gets a little um a little annoying um so yes I do agree they need to stop talking and be a little bit quieter and just let her react to it uh, I just get excited. <laughs> I think anyone can really relate to that, hopefully. Um, and longer discussion scenes at the end as well. I got that. But yeah, know that everything that you're posting, everything you're asking is coming, is going straight, you know. I'm taking it all to heart. I'm figuring things out. I've never planned on being a reaction series like this, so it's very new to me. I don't know what I'm doing half the time. I don't know what scenes to leave in, what scenes to cut out. I've seen comments like that before. I don't know what scenes are important anymore, what scenes I need to leave in, what scenes I need to leave out. Uh, it's just a lot. But yes. Uh, I'm taking it all to heart. I'm figuring things out. You know, I'm trying to figure out as someone who just enjoys Attack on Titan. I like the show. I wanted to show it to her. Um, but I'm not an expert when it comes to anime. And I'm not an expert when it comes to Attack on Titan. I've never read the manga or anything like that. So uh, it's hard whenever you're wanting to show something like that. And then you have, you know, fans of series that come to the reaction and see someone who, you know, may not know everything or what he's talking about half the time. I, I understand that it can be kind of annoying. Yeah, I don't know. Just wanted to address a couple things. A shorter video today, obviously. We were recording the uh, intro themes later tonight. And I'll hopefully have those up next week because they take a little bit longer to edit. Uh, and yeah, Attack on Titan back Monday and Wednesday. But I'm planning on actually putting out some other videos in between. Uh, a couple like shorter gaming videos and stuff I might have planned just to kind of stick up in between those. And then after Attack on Titan, we've been talking about other series to react to. Uh, she's been wanting me to react to a series called You. Some Somebody posted a comment on that. Uh, I don't remember which video is on, so I wish I could properly address the person that commented that. But my sister flipped out over it and got really excited. So, <laughs> and she wanted to react to that series. And she's been telling me about it for a long time. Uh, I can't find it. I don't know. I don't, I don't remember what the comment was. But I, you can probably know who you are if you posted the, the comment. My sister flipped that over it that'll be one of the things we might start posting fridays along with it and i have a couple maybe smaller smaller videos where i talk to the camera like this planned in between whether it's a manga or an anime or a new show i've been watching i don't know i'm just trying to plan things out right now yeah <laughs> like i said my foot's in the door of like every category whether it's video games whether it's anime whether it's manga whether it's uh comic books and comic book movies i feel like i have a, a somewhat of a knowledge in everything but i'm not super super familiar when it comes to anime and manga and i don't want to feel like i'm just like in this box although i'm fine with it right now because i obviously love this stuff but uh i'm definitely not an expert when it comes to it so heads up on that <laughs> anyways yeah that's all i wanted to say um slowly but surely figuring things out and for everyone that's new thank you so much the support has been amazing i don't even know what to say guys it's been really cool and i want to thank everyone that came over and is showing the support it, it's so cool <laughs> it's been a lot but i'm so happy uh that it that, it, that it's like this and 
this is literally a dream come true. Something I've been working towards for the past several years. Maybe I couldn't do it on my own. I don't even know if it's her that did it. I think it was just Attack on Titan in general, but I'm gonna let her keep thinking it was her. I'm saying that because she can probably hear me from the other room. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you want to see more. Uh, thank you so much for all the support and stuff for the past few days. And keep leaving suggestions, not only for her, but for me as well, because uh, we're taking them all to heart. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.